Welcome to Web3 Today. We are here with the latest updates on the blockchain world. Nike has launched the first ever virtual collection inspired by the Air Force One Low, a classic style that has been remixed hundreds of times since its debut on 1982. In response to a series of tweets by Talon Monahan, founder of MyCrypto, who revealed that an unidentified exploit has stolen over $10.5 million in crypto and NFTs since December 2022, MetaMask has denied that its wallet was the cause of the massive wallet draining operation. Australia has installed more Bitcoin ATMs than the whole Asia, which includes major economies such as China, Japan, Singapore, and India. Asia hosts 355 crypto machines, representing only 1% of total crypto. Kraken has successfully registered its Irish subsidiary, Paywood Europe Solutions Limited, with Central Bank of Ireland as a virtual asset service provider. Kraken's high vast registration demonstrates to both its client and regulators that it adheres to Europe's most robust anti-money laundering and compliance standards. The National Bank of Republic of Belarus has prepared a pilot program for central bank digital currency, according to the official news agency Beta. Pavel Kalar, chairman of the National Bank, said that the country would make a decision on the issuance of the digital Belarusian rubble by the end of the year. That is all for today. Stay tuned for more news from Web3 World. Don't forget to hit the like button and subscribe to the Ether World YouTube channel. Thank you.